Harry Maguire's brother Lawrence is set to join MK Dons on a free transfer. Maguire is a free agent after leaving Chesterfield upon the expiration of his contract. The 27-year-old spent last season on loan at Crawley and helped them win promotion to League One. He played 34 times in League Two, scoring three goals. Maguire also played every minute of the playoffs as the Red Devils won promotion with a two-leg win over MK Dons and a Wembley victory over Crewe. The centre-back described the playoff victory as a dream come true in social media post following the final. Read more in FOOTBALLDEPARTED Devils Man United confirm 8 players exits including Varane Forgotten Wonderkid Eurovision Dream Team Euros is live. Play now and compete for £50,000 prize pot in a follow-up post he added. Wow, that feeling is something that I have always wanted to experience. To do it with such a special group of players, staff and you fans is a moment that I will never forget. Relegation favourites to lifting the trophy at Wembley. Maguire has been at Chesterfield since 2015, making 167 appearances for them while also briefly being loaned out to Fylde in 2017. Most read in football M.A.D.D. Ness Madison becomes first player out of England camp with two more reportedly acts not gonna happen Solskjaer misses out on Besiktas job as ex-Arsenal star lands move freezy going Chelsea announce exits of three stars after Enzo Maresca's arrival N.O.T.T. wanted Forrest release 13 players including Ace who last played three years a G.O.B.E.S.T. free bet sign up offers for UK bookmakers his parent club earned automatic promotion into League 2 by winning the National League. He is not the only one in his family who could be on the move this summer, with older brother Harry also facing an uncertain future at Manchester United. Luke Littler takes on Harry Maguire in incredible darts challenge as fans say Man United star should switch careers, the 31-year-old England international is entering the final year of his contract at Old Trafford, but does have an option for a further year. Sun Sport revealed in March how West Ham remained interested in a cut price deal for Maguire. Sun Sport's verdict on Man United flop Sir Jim Ratcliffe and Ineos have a busy summer ahead to get Man UTD squad in order for next season. Below Sunsport gives it verdict on how they should deal with the Red Devils flops this summer. Andre Onana. Stay. After a dodgy start at Old Trafford Onana has proven to be one of the more reliable members of the squad this season despite being peppered with shots constantly. Altai Bayandir. Go. Reports in February suggested Bayandir was unhappy with his bit part role at Man United amid interest from Turkish giants Galatasaray. If profit can be made on a sale then it should be done. Tom Heaton, stay, veteran goalkeeper Heaton, 38, is a reliable backup and is on a relatively small wage at the club. So long as he is happy it makes sense to keep him. Aaron Juan Bissaka, go, Juan Bissaka, 26, has never managed to make the right back position his own. With his contract up in 2025 it makes sense to cash in now. Diogo Delot, stay, Delot, 26, has been one of Man UTD's most consistent performers this season.
Raphael Varane, go. If it wasn't for his injury record there would be a strong shout to keep Varane, but costs need to be cut to allow the squad to be freshened up. Harry Maguire, go. Maguire has showed he has the right character to be at Man United, but overall ability and desired profile are another matter, with Maguire too slow to play in a high-line defence. Lisandro Martinez, stay, Martinez, 26, is second to none in terms of build-up play. He needs a long-term defensive partner on the right side and to cut out the injuries which have plagued him this season. Johnny Evans, go, veteran campaigner Evans could easily be on the stay list if he was only going to be a bit part player. But he has shown his advanced years at times this season. Victor Lindelof, go, Lindelof, 29, has been reliable if not unremarkable in his Man United career. He has one year left on his contract so should be moved on if a decent transfer fee can be got for him. Willy Kambwala, stay. He should be given the opportunity to mature for a few years behind a senior CB pairing before stepping into the first team as a starter or being moved on. Luke Shaw. Go. One of the Premier League's best left backs when fit, Shaw has been a good servant when available. But alas that has been his Achilles heel once again this season. Terrell Malaysia, stay, Malaysia, 24, was decent enough to earn some merit in his first season at Man United before injury ended his season and inadvertently led to his second season being a write-off. Safian Amrabat, go, Amrabat, 27, looked like a world beater at the Qatar World Cup with Morocco. But H's had an underwhelming season in England and his loan spell will almost certainly not be made permanent. Casemiro. Go. An alarming physical decline has seen him turn from key star to burden. If a club is willing to buy the 32-year-old, who has two more years on his contract, then United should snatch their hand off. Christian Eriksen, go. Eriksen proved a useful asset and Ineos should look to bring in another player with similar traits, but frankly his legs have looked gone towards the end of this season. Kobe Mainu, stay. The first of the so-called untouchables, Mainu has been a rare glimmer of hope in the Red Devils midfield this season. Mason Mount, stay, Mount can be given the benefit of the doubt until summer 2025 at least after a debut season riddled with injury. Scott McTominay, stay. McTominay, 27, has proven himself to be a brilliant plan B off the bench this season, and that is exactly why Ineos should look to keep him. Bruno Fernandes, stay, Man UTD's best player since his arrival just over four years ago. Fernandes, 29, remains second to none when it comes to creating chances while his tenacity boosts those around him. Anthony, go. There's a case to argue that Anthony may be the worst pound-for-pound -pound signing in Premier League history.
Despite some memorable moments he simply isn't Man United quality. Anthony Marshall. Go. Ultimately Marshall needs to be let go when his deal runs out this summer after an appalling injury record of late. Marcus Rashford. Stay. As easy as it would be to say Rashford should leave the club this summer, it is difficult to look at the market and find many available players capable of scoring 30 goals a season. Alejandro Garnacho, stay, another third of the untouchables trio, Garnacho has made the right wing his own since coming into it. H is a raw talent but has shown he has the quality to improve. Rasmus Hodgland, stay, a slow burner in his first Man United season, the 21-year-old has often been starved of supply which has led to him being unable to get the goals his movement and unselfish play often merits. Ahmed Diallo, stay, in the fleeting moments he has been on the pitch for Man United this season, Diallo has looked dangerous and exciting. He should be given a chance to flourish with some proper chances in the first team across a whole season. However, with long-term admirer David Moyes no longer at the helm of the Hammers it remains to be seen whether Julian Lopetegui would echo his predecessor in wanting to add him to the squad. Sensational reports from Italy claim Man United have offered him to AC Milan with veteran Simon KJ leaving on a free transfer. SUNSPORTS Transfer News LIVESTAY in the know this summer with the Suns transfer experts. Real Madrid have confirmed the signing of French phenomenon Kylian Mbappe. Chelsea have announced the appointment of Enzo Maresca as the club's new head coach. Manchester City are reportedly keen on tying Erling Haaland down to a new deal. Follow our live transfer blog for all the latest deals, gossip and exclusives.